Oh, James, isn't that sword fabulous? Indeed, it was used by Japan's first shogun warrior, about 1200 A.D., if I remember my history. Close, it was 1190. What was that? No, Tracy! Don't try to stop them! Tracy! 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 You're supposed to be inside, studying the Japanese exhibit. Sorry, sir. I guess we're just a couple of dropouts. behind this because it has all the markings of one of their fiendish plots what fiendish plot is the question yeah there's lots of neat stuff to rip off in the british museum so why go for some funky old sword because it wasn't just any funky old sword it was a very special sword the sword of power from the kamakura period a shogun sword fashioned from the metal of a meteor According to the book, the sword's magic helped the Emperor Yoritomo come to power. Awesome! Just like Excalibur and that King Arthur dude. This is all very interesting, but it doesn't explain... Why Scum wants the sword so badly? Exactly. This may hold the answer. A rose? Whoa, IQ. I didn't know you were also a buttonist. That's buttonist. Oh, yeah? So how come he's wearing it in his buttonhole? If you examine it very closely, you'll see it's a fake. This is my newest invention, the micro camera. IQ, how could you? Cameras aren't allowed in the British Museum. Don't worry, we won't turn you in. If the pictures give us a clue to what scum is up to. Ow! Who stepped the mic? Watch your shoulder. Ow! Time to shed a little light on the subject. You managed a photograph of the hilt. Could you blow this one up? Certainly, James. While you're at it, I'd like a half a dozen wallet size. <laughs> Just as I suspected. It looks like a map. That's exactly what it is, Tracy. And I'll wager that's what scum is after. But why? What is it a map of? An excellent question, IQ. Unfortunately, the answer is written in code. Hey, I'll bet my dad could break it. I doubt it, Gordo. It's written in ancient Japanese. There aren't more than a half dozen scholars in the world who could decipher it. I'll bet Professor Tanaka that the man who wrote this book could break the code. Gnarly notion. Only he's in Japan. Oh, bummer. We've got to get to Japan somehow. So, you're thinking about going to Japan, eh? Trevor, you were eavesdropping. Of course. <laughs> How else would I know what to tell Mr. Milbanks? Aw, oh, don't do it, Trevor. Try and stop me. All right, everyone out the track. I have to see Mr. Milbanks, Coach Mitchell. After track. Oh, all right. Ta-ta! See you in detention! <laughs> Come on, guys! Well, if Trevor tells Milbanks, we're done for. Not if I get my hands on that creep first. Crude, but effective, Gordo. But I have a better idea. 
You're signing Trevor up for cross-country running? He needs the exercise. Are you in for it? <laughs> All right, come on in. Okay, into the showers. Uh, except you, Noseworthy. You've signed up for cross-country. Cross-country? But I didn't... Uh, no excuses. It'll be an easy run today, just 15 miles. 15 miles? I'll even run halfway with you. Come on! You did this, Bond! I'll get you! Save your breath, Trevor! You'll need it! All right! I'll get you to the village, but you're on your own after that. No problem, Mr. Mitchell. Daddy's delivery company is scheduled to pick up packages there, and we're one of the packages. Oh, uh, where to, Mr. Mitchell? Oh, one of my runners is doing cross-country. I'm going out to check on him. And these students? We're his cheerleading section. IQ, did you remember to bring what I asked for? My collapsible mini crossbow? How could I forget? Good, I hope it works when I need it. My devices always work, but sometimes in unexpected ways. Infrared goggles to see in the dark. Those would be great on a date in a dark movie house. Wow, Tokyo's a real toddling town. Awesome threads. Uh, they're called kimonos. I call them knockouts. Ooh, I simply love shopping. Yeah, this is better than spending the day at the mall. The National Museum is where Professor Tanaka works. Why don't you go see the sights while I get this decoded? Most excellent division of chores, James. You work and we play. I thought you'd like it. Sorry, Mr. Bond. Professor Tanaka is not here at the moment. I don't mind waiting. I'll just admire the scenery. I am afraid you will have quite a long wait. He meditates at the Buddhist temple every afternoon. This is the address. Tell me, are you into meditation? Hmm. I'll have to meditate on that. But Mr. Mitchell, I've got to talk to Mr. Milbanks. Of course, Trevor, but you need to rest a bit first. You ran a long way today, and tonight. <sighs> I am tired. Just take a little rest, sleep, sleep. Professor Tanaka? Hmm? Yes, I am Professor Tanaka. The name is Bond, James Bond. I must speak to you. Thank you for respecting our customs, young man. Believe me, it's my pleasure. How may I be of service? Huh? What are you doing? Why are you taking me? The police! Just the people I wanted to see.